Hey, good evening, guys. It's David Cruz here. <clears throat> Little frog in my throat, excuse me. And uh, one of the questions that we get the most from people who need website help on the Wix platform, on any platform, that is, uh, we do websites other than on the Wix platform, but that's what we prefer. We, we really don't want to build anything else on any other platforms. We love Wix. You guys should love Wix. But um, one of the top questions we get is how, you know, you, you'll upload an image onto the website and it doesn't look right because it has a background in it. And you needed something like this with no background that just shows the, uh, the logo art without that big white box that, that you see so many times or a background like this here. Okay, this is uh, obviously a picture of a glass, uh, a, a glass full of daiquiri, excuse me. How do you get that? How do you make that happen uh, with a uh, image with no background? So that's what I wanna show you guys real quick. Very big deal for most. So we were in preview mode with this particular client's website and we are going to show you how to do that. All right, so big tip. Okay, I've made a copy of the page that we're going to do experimentation on. Big tip there. Listen, I'm gonna actually walk through this in case you don't know how to do it because once your website is where you want it, you don't wanna just go messing stuff up. So let's go to this page because this page looks right. Okay, and I was gonna show you the page, but I think I'll just move on. We're gonna duplicate that new pages new page comes up copy of home it is not visible okay it, it's not published but it's not even visible on the menu so nobody in the real world knows what we're doing only only us and that is where we can do our experimenting all right so again nobody knows it so we're going to get rid of this because we're going to create one of those going to get rid of this how'd you like that you thought the logo was on the glass didn't you nope that's an image by itself Anyway, so we need that styrofoam, delicious, glad looking uh, cup filled with delicious daiquiri. If you're ever in Long Beach, Mississippi, this place has amazing daiquiris. It's one block off the beach. You can see the beach view from the, yeah, it is amazing. It is the margarita mindset and I love it. Hang out there for hours. Anyway, so uh, yeah, we already did that. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're going to add an image. Well, there we go. All right, we're going to go to my image uploads because now this is the folder. This is the Coastal Daiquiri folder. We're going to find, now that's it already cut out. Notice I use that term cut out. So let's go here and We're going to use this image. You click on, you select, means it's got the, the blue line around it. You're going to select this image. You're going to go to the tools that allow you to manipulate your image. I say manipulate, edit. It's another word for that. You're going to go to cut out and auto cut out. And that got rid of most of the background. Now we've got a few little hangers on here. Sometimes it blends with your uh, background of your website. Sometimes it does not. In this case, let's say, no, 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 no. I don't think that's good enough. I think we need to get rid of that. So let's refine our cutout. We're going to use erase. And we're going to Use this tool to erase those rough edges. We need to change the size because right now, if you can look, you can see that faded circle right there. Well, it's a little too big to mess with these edges. So let's shrink the size of that tool just a bit. And we're going to, uh-oh, look what we're doing. We're getting rid of that. But we also got rid of some of the cup. That's okay, we can deal with that in a minute. You, try, you don't try to get rid of the, the cup, but I did. I erased some here, I erased some here. 
that's okay. We're going to go to fix edges. We're going to make that a little bigger. And we're going to click and drag. And look at that. Look at what it did. It rounded my edges back out. We're going to do that here. Bam, it fixed the edges. I actually went a little too deep in there and that's why it got a little red down inside of there, but that's no worries. I should have been a little bit higher, but you get the message, okay? The main part, main purpose in this is as a tutorial, not to get perfect. We're going to click apply. And then there's our cup. We're going to save. There's our edited image. Make sure it's highlighted and we're going to add it to the page. And now we have a big giant picture of a, a cup of daiquiri. Okay, so we're going to shrink this to a realistic usable size. And that's still not small enough. Let's, let's do this. Let's drag this over here. Let's do this. Now we're going to go and grab this little joker right here and we're going to turn that to match the other one. And there we go. Still just a shade big, but it'll work. No sweat. You know, we just keep, keep monkeying with these nodes that drag and resize that. We're going to go over here and we're going to highlight this image. Then we're going to duplicate that image. We're going to drag that over here. This wasn't really part of the part of the um, tutorial, but we're going to fit it in there since we're already here. And you just want to play with that a little, make it right, kind of resize it, put it on our styrofoam cup, Let's go see what that looks like. Preview mode. There we go. We have a daiquiri with no background. You know, we could have finessed it a little bit more. There's a little bit there, but you get the point. Um, and that's how you do it. But those are the tools. It will give you an image with no background. And I'm telling you, it's a lot easier right here in your website. It's called a CMS, Content Management System. That's what Wix is. It's a content management system for your website. It manages the content of your website. It's a lot easier to do it right here than having to go learn how to do that in Photoshop or Illustrator or GIMP or one of those programs that takes forever to learn. It's right here with these tools. And I just gave you the tutorial to do that and perfect it. So there you go. Okay, guys. Hey, be on the lookout. If this, if this helps you, uh, if this has helped you any, share this because we're in a, an unprecedented time of, of changes and small in, in, in culturally, economically, uh, marketing, there's huge marketing changes. So if you know anyone that is in small business that needs small business survival help, how to get things done for a little or no money out of pocket, share this with them. Thanks, guys. Have a fantastic afternoon.